What is galvanizing? A factory controlled metallurgical combination of zinc and steel that provides barrier and cathodic protection against corrosion. The first requirement is to remove oils and grease and old paint coatings. This is normally done in hot strong alkali solutions or by abrasive blasting or by acid cleaning and rinsing. The next step is fluxing to prevent oxidation. The chemically clean, highly active steel surface is immersed in a flux solution that removes any oxide film that might have formed on the highly reactive steel surface after acid cleaning and prevents further oxidation before galvanizing. The structure is then dried and ready for galvanizing. The actual galvanizing reaction takes place at between 445 and 465 degrees Celsius. The dried steel part that results in the actual galvanized zinc layer. The steel structure is treated using the hot dip galvanizing method which involves dipping the structure into a galvanizing kettle which contains zinc. Once this is done, immediately a metallurgical alloy is formed between the zinc and the steel which results in a thin molecular layer of brittle, hard high iron zinc alloy called the gamma layer. Next, a much thicker and hard brittle layer is formed called delta layer containing 7 to 12 percent iron. On top of this, the zeta layer containing about 6 percent iron. And finally, the eta layer which is quite ductile providing the coating with some impact resistance. The second and the third layer are almost twice as strong that the underlying steel. IS11759 lists various zinc touch-up methods like zinc alloy solders, zinc spraying and zinc painting for repair of damaged hot dip galvanized coatings like in welding. After welding, you can be rest assured that all bare spots will be well protected.